Namaste. Welcome, ladies and gentlemen. It's Anita Tadavarthi. I'm a licensed acupuncturist with over 20 years of acupuncture, acupressure experience. I have treated almost 100,000 patients in my lifetime. I wanted to do just a simple video that you could have, that you could use, that you could do either on yourself or a loved one, a family member, a child, or your parent, that if someone is struggling with anxiety or just had a panic attack or had a loss in their family or is suffering from anger, this would be a very good video. Also, this set of points on the face that I'm about to share with you can also just be helpful if you need to relax after a tough day or if you want to give a little bit of care for your friends and family, something simple that you can do for yourself and for another person. We're gonna do each point for about a minute and when we do the point, I'm just going to simply explain just for a second why they work. And this simple protocol, if you can save this video and have it, then can re be really helpful in helping your mind and your body relax as well as someone that you care about. First point we're going to do, and we're going to do it for about a minute, is on the top of the face. It's on the vertex and also the lateral aspect. The best way that I've seen this work is if you just gently use your fingernails and massage this area. A lot of times when stress happens, we carry it right here, and this helps dissipate that tension. So we're gonna do this together for the next minute. Follow along with me, and you can of course do these points while yourself or someone you love is laying down. But I'm just gonna do it in this position for illustration purposes. Here we go. next point is along the midline of the face and the midline of the face not only represents the front of the body but also the back of the body relaxes the whole body let's do this for the next minute This next acupressure point, I feel so refreshed when I do it. It's from Yin Tong, above the eyebrows to the temple, along the jawline, all the way up towards the eyes. We're gonna do this point for the next minute. Follow along with me.
This next acupressure point can be really helpful to calm someone down. Oftentimes when someone is upset, their blood pressure may rise. With blood pressure issues, you should always talk to your doctor, but a simple protocol that you can do is to massage the rim of the ear. So just simply from where the ear attaches to the head along the rim all the way down to the earlobe. I like to do my points bilaterally, so we'll do it on both sides. Here we go. This next acupressure point is on the end. It is located on the skull and it is behind the ear. It is located on the medial inferior edge of the skull, which is called a mastoid process. So it's located right there. And this is a great point if someone's having difficulty sleeping. Often if someone had a stressful day or lost a loved one, they are having um, difficulty sleeping. I know that from personal experience. So this is a great point for calming the body to sleep. Also, if you're waking up early or if you're not waking up well rested, this is a great point. So for the next minute, what I'd like for you to do is to just take your fingertips or a finger, go behind the ear and then hit the bone right behind the ear. Wherever you feel that it's tender, and you can ask if you're doing this on someone else if that spot is a little achy. Well, whatever is achy, that's the spot, and we want to do that for the next minute. Here you go. Keep this video and do it as many times as you need on yourself or someone else. I wish you all the best from your friend, Anita Tadavarthi.